Yo, Aki gang, what's going on? It's your boy RK back with another amazing exchanges video. So, yep, the 96 for 97 exchange is back. So let me show you the requirements and also how much does it cost actually. So, yeah, this is the 96 for 97 exchange, and these are all the possible outcomes: Theatore, Cola, Ronaldo, Ruth Hallett, Maldini, Lota Matthias, Eusebio, Rodri, Messi, Haaland, and Mohamed Salah. There's no Ronaldo, guys. I wish he was there in the pack. Uh, you know, it would have been good. But anyways, yeah, these are the possible outcomes comes and come into the pricing so the yaya tori card is going for 96 million but before we have a look at the player prices let's see how much does this exchange actually cost so you need 295 obr players heroes or team of the year and you need 392 to 94 uh, tradable players uh, any version and then 89 to 95 any version guys so the 95 rated cards they're going for 38 million coins their price increased a lot uh, today morning they were at like 29 million and right now in the evening time they're like 36 37 yeah they reached 38 million guys so 38 million for each 95 so that's a 76 million coins and the next one is 92 to 94 let's have a look at the cheapest 92 rated card and the cheapest 92 yeah it's like 5.5 million coins and you need three of these uh, cards guys so that's like plus 15 million i mean plus 16.5 million coins so that's like 92 million coins and then you need 589 to 90 OVR players and that's gonna cost you like extra 7 million coins. So overall you're looking like at least 95 million coins for this exchange. Let's see the dub pulls and the L pulls from this. If you get the Yaya Tour record, I think that's not a big L but still you're making like a bit of loss because after you sell this store, Yaya Tour record, uh, you're gonna you know lose 10% in tax so yeah I think you'll make like 10 million coins loss if you get Yaya Tour but it's not a big L guys and coming to Kolo, you're gonna make a huge loss here, you're gonna make at least 30 million coins loss here which is bad and the RNN card is obviously one of the biggest uh, you know plus uh, I mean biggest W's you can pack and same with Lord Hullet last time I got Lord Hullet and KDB and the previous time I got R9 and coming to Lothar Matthews I think he's a L as well and Maldini is a W and Eusebio how much is Eusebio going for even he's a small loss guys uh, so Rodri is a loss Messi is a profit Haaland is a, uh, I mean, I think Haaland is break even. Yeah, he's break even, guys. Mohamed Salah is going to give you profit, guys, if you pack him. So I think it's, there's a 30% good ones, 70% bad ones you can get. And to purchase all the players required, we spent 200 million coins. So that's like, you know, 100 million coins per exchange. So let's go, guys. I'm hoping for the best. Uh, I hope I make some coins back from this, some profit if possible. Uh, if you get profit, it's gonna be good, you know. Uh, so let's go. This is gonna be the first one of the day. Come on, EA Sports, and it's a team of the version, and it's Mexico. What? Wait, did EA just scam me, guys? This is wrong. I thought, I thought these are the only places that are possible right now. No freaking way, guys. EA has actually scammed me. So I spent 100 million for a 36 million coins card. Wow, that is very bad, guys. Not gonna lie, EA scammed me. If I knew that all these slow 96 rated cards are available, I would I would have never done this exchange. I swear, guys. So yep, that's a big L. We are taking like 70 million coins loss, and in order to you know make it back, I got to pack Road Hullet in this. It's pain. It's definitely a big loss. I made like at least 100 million coins loss, guys. That is very disappointing if I'm if I'm being very honest guys. I mean 61 million plus 36 million 97 million. I, I didn't even make coins for the one exchange back. Wow What a big fat L guys. That's a big L not gonna lie. Let's do this 87 to 97 exchange So here we go. Hopefully I get someone good here. So let's go guys Here comes the exchange and it's a normal walkout and it's gonna be Japan right back Okay, oh Tomiyasu, 90 rated Tomiyasu, that's not bad. And yep, this is what we got. Let's move on to the next one. Good to go. This is the second exchange, guys. Let's go and see what we're packing in this one. And it's a winter wild card. Brazil? Right with Pepe? Ah, uh, never mind, that's 87. Yeah, 87. All 87s, guys. That's a bad one. Here we go, guys. The final one. Let's have a look at the 87 to 97 exchange. It's a normal walkout, guys. Algeria. Oh, that's Riyad Mahrez, guys. So that's decent. I mean, decent card. So let's go 89 to 97. Here we go. The first exchange in the 89 to 97. So it's going to be a normal walkout. Japan once again. Send him at this time. That's Wataru Endo. No, it's not. Who is this guy? I've got no clue. That's Morita, guys. So that's what we got. Morita and Gurasi. Uh, 89 to 97. It's a team of the walkout. All right. France. Left back Theo Hernandez. Please be the 95. I mean, yeah, I don't really need him, but still. 
guys this is a 91 guys you know oh wow double theo hernandez that's not bad because i can probably get his normal tradable version and rank the tradable version with these and i can make a few coins maybe so yeah that's not bad guys that's not at all bad for sure all right guys now i'm on my second account so let's have a look at the players that we're gonna get so yep here we go i spent 200 million coins in this account as well for buying all the players guys exactly 199 million coins and the first one is portugal striker ronaldo no that's eusebio guys i mean that's fine that's fine compared to the previous account pulls this is decent eusebio is absolutely fine yeah we are making loss here for sure but not big losses so i can probably sell him for 95 million coins so i'm making like probably 13 to 40 million coins loss which is better than the 100 million coins which i got before so yep that's the first one guys that's not at all bad if it was ronaldo that would have been ultimate you know and the second one is here okay it's the egyptian king mohammed salah guys it's the egyptian king mohammed salah not at all bad let's freaking go 97 obr and on this account i think we are making profit now i'm we are definitely making a little bit of profit so guys on my other account i bought all the players required for the exchange we spent 200.74 million coins exactly on this account so yep that's like 100 million coins per exchange just like the previous two accounts so hopefully we get some better pulls here and we make some profit so yep let's go begin the first 96 to 97 exchange here comes the exchange pack guys let's go and see what we're gonna get here comes the first one. It's a team off there, all right. That's good to see. Portugal once again. Cam, no freaking way, guys. That's a big L. He's going for 45 million. Bernardo Silva. That's a L. 45 million coins. I made. I made like half of the coins that I spent for this exchange. Oh my god, that is actually very bad. But anyways, let's move on to the next one. Here comes the next pack. Come on. It's once again team of the Walker. Portugal once again. Oh my god, what the heck is going on, EA? two portugal but not even one ronaldo no freaking way guys that's that's actually very bad okay 70 million is not big loss as bernardo silo but still is a loss overall i'm making like 100 million coins both the players combined guys that's actually very bad value guys you know what this is a very big gamble exchange the the, the probability of making profit is actually quite low guys not gonna lie so don't do this exchange in my opinion but yeah if you got those pay coins lying in your club yeah definitely give it a try but i wouldn't if, I, if I'm running low on coins, I wouldn't do it. But anyways, we've got a couple more exchanges on this account. I can do this 93 to 97. So let's go do this one, guys. Here we go. This is actually quite an expensive exchange, guys. But you know what? Let's have a look. It's a hero player, obviously. England. Uh, who's this? Center back. Oh, Ledley King. That's a big fat L. Okay, Ledley King is bad. 93 OVR. So that's bad for sure. So we are looking for Gaia Torre, guys, in, in this exchange and Kohler as well. Anything among these two. England once again, that's Ledley King once again. Nah, that's that's so bad, man. So here comes the exchange pack and it's going to be Australia. Okay, that's Irvine. Yeah, that's Irvine, guys. Yeah, here we go. With the next exchange and... <laughs> All right, here comes the next 87 to 97 exchange. It's going to be... Who's this? CDM. Uh, Crystal Palace, no, that's Dokore, no, it's not Dokore, that's Kamara, guys, that's Kamara, and we got Mikel Marino, so, that's what we got, and the final one, final 87 to 97, let's have a look, let's have a look, guys, and it's Icon Walkout, guys, Germany, right mid, ah, oh, that's Ricken, that's Ricken, guys, I hate this card to the core, to be honest, yeah, when the Winter Wild card even came, I was packing him, like, in every 6 or 7 pack, so, yeah, so, let's go complete this exchange, guys, hoping for something good, you know, not even a single good pull from this 87 to 97 today. And it's a hero, guys. England. Don't be lead licking. Okay, this time it's a striker. Peter Crouch. Is it Peter Crouch, guys? Yeah, that's Peter Crouch. Let's go. We, we packed the tallest striker in FC Mobile. From the 89 to 97 exchange. So, wow. What's his height? 201 centimeters, guys. Let's go on to the next 89 to 97. Here we go. Come on, EA. I'm sure you're, you're, you know, you're saving a big pack for me. It's an icon or a hero, guys. Saudi Arabia, right mid? No, it's center forward. That's Al Jabber, guys. Imagine if that was a right wing or a right mid. That would have been a big pull. But you know what? That's fine, guys. Also, guys, on the second, I've got 11,000 gems. So let's just open this 88 to 96 into do Ramadan pack. You know, I want to make a few coins back, at least. You know, let's have a look. Jordan, striker. Nah, that's bad. That's bad. Yeah, we got Altamari and we got Kabak. That's L, guys. So 
All right, guys. So this is gonna be the final account in which I'm gonna be opening that 96 to 97 exchange. So I got all the required players, and one second it costed me 200 million coins for all the required players. So let's go and complete this exchange, guys. Hopefully, at least in, on the second we get some profit, guys. Here we go. The packs open. It's gonna be Germany. That's Lothar Matthäus, right? That's Lothar Matthäus. Uh, so I think that's not the biggest L's, but still it's a L. We are making like 20 to 30 million coins loss from this one. Yeah, 74.5. I think we can sell him for 80 million coins. Yeah, I can sell him for 80 million coins after tax. That's like 72 million coins are made back. So yeah, 28 million coins lost, guys, from this exchange. So kind of bad. But you know what? That's better than packing Bernardo Silva and also packing Sanchez, Hugo Sanchez. So let's go on to the final one of the day. The final 96 to 97. Here we go. So it's a team of the workout, all right. Norway, please be Haaland. Oh yeah, there's only one possibility. Haaland, Haaland, here we go Haaland. So we got Haaland guys and yeah, this is not a loss for sure. I can sell him for 110 million coins easily. So I'm making all the coins which I spent for this exchange back. Uh, but it's just break even guys. A Haaland card is just a break even. Unfortunately today I couldn't back any of those expensive players guys. Uh, the last time it was fantastic but this time not that case. And the final one of the day guys because I've got uh, no fodder left to complete more exchanges on this account. So let's have a look at the player. It's a window wild card. Morocco. Goalkeeper. Yasir Bunau. Not bad. That's not bad. So we got the Moroccan goalkeeper, Yasir Bunau, and yep, this is what we got. That's a final uh, pack, guys. So yes, guys, I think that's the end of the video. Uh, so we have opened this 96 to 97 exchange in four or five accounts. And out of all those four or five accounts, I think I made break even only in one account, guys. Just solid accounts. So I'm making loss. So yep, I, I would say this is a very high risk exchange. I would say, uh, I mean, I would suggest you to avoid guys, especially with a new event coming soon uh, in two days. I would definitely uh, avoid this exchange. So yep, that's it. I hope you all have enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to subscribe to my channel and go watch this video next.